I don't, I don't guess I don't really remember that song. Uh, greetings, I am Cross Knights, and this is Let's Play Stardew Valley, and it's Christmas! Not at the time that I record this, but in Stardew, it's essentially Christmas. Living off the land, now listen up. Ever heard the urge to dig around a neighbor's crap? <laughs> never, I've never had the urge to dig around a neighbor's trash. Ew, hey, if that's your thing, just don't do it when anyone's around. If they notice you, they'll be seriously grossed out and it'll harm your friendship. Well, unless they're into that kind of thing. I mean, that's not true. Linus is into that kind of thing, and apparently if he's around you, uh, it still lowers his friendship, which I think it would have been really cool if they just coded it so that was not the case, but they didn't do that. Also, that song was, you know, the, the map in, in Chrono Trigger in the future stage? That's what I was trying to do. There's, like, banging in the background. But, um... I have to be honest, when I started doing that whole Kazoo Chrono Trigger song thing, I didn't think the LP was going to go on for 40 episodes. And I have completely... I, I don't have any more songs. I, 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 I mean, I have... You know what? I should bite the bullet and do one of them, actually. I can do the Lavos one. But, uh, you know, the end theme I kind of want to save for the last episode. Um, but I have a plan. I think I'm going to be kazooing uh, Chrono Cross music. I might have mentioned that in the past, but, like, I'm definitely doing it. And I, I think I have to do it... I wanted to do it, like, in the new year, so maybe I should just make sure that the new year happens this episode. But I can't guarantee that. It might be super duper long. Um. Oh, I should keep that fish taco for show. Um. Yeah, sell these, though. And this. Let's cram these glasses in here. And it'll be time for, uh, it'll be time for Christmas, sure enough, so I should do my animal duties. A fist, a very fist. Yeah. All right, no, a taser, no, please, please, no. Why? Oh, I, I already, I already, <laughs> I already got the hay. Way more hay than I needed. I just somehow thought that I didn't have the hay. Hey, cram. Here. There we go. There's Daglas. Poor Daggle is not happy enough. Not happy enough. I've been petting them each day. I don't know. It's going up pretty slow, isn't it? And I don't want to incubate, incubate any more eggs because um, I think I want other animals than, than chickens and ducks. Even though, you know, they're the easiest to get a lot of because you don't have to buy them. There's no initial cost. I just took even more hay out of them. <laughs> Whatever. I won't have to worry about that very soon. Everything will be fed automatically, at least in this barn. Goat kid! Yeah! Mr. Cow's rules there. Alright, so... Do a little cramming and a little jamming. No, no. Jamming. No, what? Oh, I'm trying to put cheese in the cheese press. They deny me my cheese-ception, and this makes me sad. Christmas is going to start very soon. Ah, oh, but I got eggplants and a chili pepper. Ooh, and sunflower seeds. I had a plan with these sunflower seeds. And that plan is to, after I uh, harvest them, because you get more, you get more sunflower seeds, I just plop them back down. It's the, the, the perpetual crop, except it didn't seem to give me as many as I got, but it did pretty good. But good, we finished that just in time. Let's go to Chrissymas. Oh, the candy canes are everywhere. <laughs> Today is a time to be thankful for the year's good fortune. Forget your worries for the day and relax. Welcome to the Festival of the Winter Star. Alright. Hmm. I'm, st <sighs> I'm still upset that I didn't win the fishing competition. Yeah, but you were against me, and Willie, so, you know. What a beautiful tree. Do you want to hear the legend about the Winter Star? Sure. In the night sky of winter, there is a bright star only visible in this valley. No one knows why this is. But in times of old, people would come from afar and wide to see it. I thought they said, but in times of old people, there should have been a comma between old and people. 
They believed that anyone who laid eyes upon the Winter Star would be blessed with good fortune. Some even claimed that a mysterious fruit, known as the Star Drop, is connected to the Winter Star in some way. That threw me off for a long time when he said that, because I assumed that you could get a Star Drop with this event somehow, and you cannot, so I don't know why he says that. I wonder if it was, like, deleted content. Ooh, presents! Well, you're not allowed to open them yet, miss. Hmm. Good afternoon. Afternoon. Oh. Yes. I'm gonna give you your secret present. Oh, so it's you. Ah, a coconut. Thanks. Oh, no. Don't tell me that ended the event. Oh, my God, Abigail is my secret Santa person. That is crazy. Also, I'm a bad boyfriend. <laughs> because I kind of asked her out and then didn't talk to her at all. I got distracted. Hi, so I'm your secret gift giver this year. Well, open it. <laughs> she gave me beer. You received a beer. It's nothing fancy, but it's the best I could afford. Catface. Excellent. Okay, good. That didn't end Christmas. Nothing like a piping hot feast in a cold winter day, huh? Oh. I've had too much nog. <laughs> My sales figures are phenomenal lately. Ah, thanks to the feast of the winter star. Yeah, everyone's buying gifts. Hi, Chrono. That's all you have to say, really? All right. Hiya, Krona. You're welcome to join our family table if you need company. Spending time with family is tiring sometimes. I'll probably get another tool set this year. Uh, can we open presents now? No. You have to wait until I leave. I mean, I got to open my presents, suckers. In fact, I'd crack open that beer right now, but I can't open my inventory. I'm thankful for my guitar and my skateboard. Oh, and my family, I guess. As a tertiary concern. It's not a good time of year for a diet. Oh, hello. What is wrong? Why does he look so sad? Oh my, aren't you cold, dealer? It's freezing. Feast for some stupid star. <laughs> Humbug. Alright, Scrooge. I hope there's a new camera for me under the spirit tree. Chrono, what are you hoping to find under the spirit tree? Um... Jar of spiced mead would be cool. Ooh, that sounds nice. Make sure to give me a taste. Nope, I got beer and you ain't having none. Gus was just telling me about his artisan candy canes. Ugh. <sighs> It's a fine art of making candy canes. You really gotta search far and wide for the best ingredient. These aren't easy to come by these days. Why, hello, Chrono. It's chilly, isn't it? Ugh, all these happy people and their families. But for me, is just another lonely near. I've met some people who believe in spirits and magic. But me... I've never seen anything that couldn't be explained by science. I'm thankful there are no medical emergencies this year. It's fair. I think... I think we're good. I don't think there's any weird... extraneous, uh... doings, happenings. So... And I can't search for the garbage, sadly. Yeah, I think we're just gonna move on, then. Yeah, he doesn't activate any event, and I can't actually leave anywhere. But awesome! I'm gonna go and get drunk. Yes. There we go. That's the stuff. All right. So we got fish tacos, and we got the mayonnaise of the void. Now I just think, I don't know, what if Abigail doesn't like me because I haven't talked. Nope, she's good. We got we got understanding me and her. 
that has existed ever since I gave her a pumpkin. How did I get here? I should probably go to bed. I don't need to hang around just because there's a star who is famous. Oh, okay, my head just cleared up. A diamond! <laughs> Let's go sell that. Let's make some money this day. Actually, we'll put this in. Oh no, my controller is... It's finally happened. <laughs> it's all that bro force. The, the, um... Like, the most important key, the X key, is messing up. Or the A key. Yeah, did I make any... Actually, I, you know, since I had those crops, I made a decent amount today. Well... Oh, yeah. Well, even for... A lot of that was for my animals anyway, but yeah. The crops definitely helped. Alright. Winter is certainly close to being over. That's for sure. Um, Robin should actually be working on my house today. I don't think she was yesterday because it was Christmas. Um, oh, it's Clint's birthday! Let's get him a nice golden bar. That'll be good. Alright. Also, I need to see Abigail today, so I'm gonna have to plot myself in front of her house so she can't escape. Um, dear Chrono, I want to make fish stew, but I need an albacore. I know they're almost out of season. Sorry about the show. Nerdist, did you catch me one? I'm having trouble speaking. I cut out a large amount of my flubbing of those lines, but, like, it was way more than it should be. Oh my god, I have one. Did I save one specifically because I remembered that was going to happen? Maybe. I also know there's a Link Cod quest, but I don't think that's till next year. Cool, so I can give that to Gus. Um... I really do need to start... I need to concentrate on bachelors, getting them up to max. Emily is maxed. Abigail needs attention, obviously. Maru. Harvey. Harvey. I can Harvey. I can Harvey Holly. <laughs> Who's the lowest? I mean, probably Leah at this point, because I... No, of course it's Sam. I never see Sam. Um, do I have a cola for him? I'll just start... No, I got rid of all the colas, didn't I? Because I thought it was dumb. I kept on having all those colas. Um, oh, you see that? He's not gra I should be grabbing them rhythmically, but the button is messing up. And I just recorded Cuphead today, like... Imagine if it was screwing up then. It would have messed up everything. Oh, well. 203 is currently in our um, hometown. I, uh, I didn't go with her, because, I don't know, we had just been there for, like, Christmas and stuff. And she was just, like, visiting a friend, so, like, I would have just been in her mother's house again. So it's like, I can just be here and do all the things that I would do there. So, yeah. Um, why am I fishing again? There was a reason. I don't remember that reason. Alright, whatever. Come 8 o'clock, though. Making a beeline to town. We're gonna make sure Abigail does not escape talking to me. Also, let's see Robin. There you are, Robin. I knew you existed. Um, there you go. And we got... We got some milk. Eh. You, do you like chili peppers? Yeah. <laughs> Be patient. I still have a lot of work to do. I know. I know. Did the, did the cows not eat? Oh, that's right. I don't think... <laughs> it's a weird phenomenon. I don't think uh, animals eat on holidays. It's like they decide to fast. So yeah, all the food is still there. <laughs> Which, you know, ridiculous, but whatever. Hey. <laughs> you talk to me, Daglas. You don't ignore me. Ooh. We got Iridium eggs. The most highest quality of eggs around. That's great. Yeah. Hey, Pam. How's it going? No! <laughs> Why does fate conspire against us, Abigail? Oh, and that's locked until noon. Oh, man. <laughs> Why was there trash in here? Who does that? This is a place for bread. Ugh. Well, now I just have to hope that she leaves her house 
which may or may not happen. Here's some Harvey for Holly. No, but that can't be. Apparently is, though. Oh, well. Why do you do this? Hey, this kind of looks like a leak. Right? Uh, I don't know. Here you want... There we go. <laughs> you know, I think that was a neutral response at the very least. No, I... No, I just... I've been thinking. Maybe I've been a bit of a grouch. I think you're being a grouch right now. It's happening in real time, George. Abigail. <laughs> Come on, the house. Abigail. <laughs> Can I climb? What? Alright, we're going to ignore the fact that the horse is a witch. Alright, well, at least I can give him the thing. Even though Abigail's not going to leave her house, presumably. <laughs> ah, what's that? It smells like an abacore! Ah, you brought it! Thanks a million! No problem. Fish stew, boom. Nice payday. How's Gus like? I mean, I don't see him too much, so he's probably... Oh, wow, he's one of the lowest. Actually, I mean, he's got he's got five stars, so he's not really... It's like he's one of the lowest, comparatively, but he's not low. He's not, like, in sandy or weird shadow person territory. Okay. Well... Can you tell your daughter to, um, leave her house? Here, take a... Flower. There you go. <laughs> I'd give one for your husband too, but I can't get into your shop to talk to my girlfriend. Who, by the way, your daughter's my girlfriend. Maybe you let me let me in. I'm also one of your most valued customers. Maybe do me solid. Uh, hey, Gus. How's it going? You being a mopey? Yeah, no, you're being a mopey mope. It's pretty depressing. You know what'll make you feel better? Solid gold bars. You remember my birthday? I'm impressed. Thanks. No problem, Gussy Gus. Gus? You're not Gus. You're Clint. I'm glad he didn't correct me, though. He is now the third person to be maxed out. That means I never need to talk to him again. <laughs> I'm done with you, G g cl cl gloss done with you <laughs> but that's good more holly yes I eventually stopped uh, trying to get Abigail's attention and just went to the mines but I got some good stuff so you know sigh eh, eh. um I guess I'll keep the hardwood I actually saw Shane on the way back so I gave him a, uh, a gift of a frozen tear, so that was nice. Looks like I'm keeping most of the rest of this. Well, that's nice. Hardwood. Uh, sap. That. I really don't need that many, um, <laughs> a slime things, but there is something pretty cool you can do with them later, so. Not begrudging it. Still need like 30, uh, solar essences, though, if I want to get the thing that I'll eventually want to get. But, you know, whatever. I think I'll keep this diamond. Just cuz. And... Yeah. That'll do. Okay, now I'm pretty empty. Should probably eat that fish taco. <laughs> I'm just carrying it around with my... Eat it or put it in the fridge. Mining leveled up. I can now make a crystallarium. Which is an investment that pays itself off way down the line. But, it, if you know, you put a diamond in there, it doesn't pay itself off. That's, you know, 700 bucks every five days just for doing nothing. Um, so let's check it out. What do I need to make one of them? Uh, is that it? That's it. Oh my. That's, um, that's a lot, actually. <laughs> it would take a very long time to pay itself off, really. I mean... That's actually a debatable thing to say. It's just the iridium, iridium's really hard to get. Um, as far as actual value of... Re I mean, I can make one now. I'd rather make Iridium Sprinklers, though, to be honest. So, we're not going to do that. 
One, so this is the last day, or tomorrow's the last day of winter. Okay. That is fair. Chrono, I'm really glad you've become part of our community. I've enclosed a 500G check from the Stardew Valley Agricultural Fund to help you continue your good work. Maybe you can buy some more seeds with it. Sincerely, Mr. Lewis. So he just gave me 500 is's. That's pretty damn great. Um, okay, so I'm definitely going to go to Abigail today. And I'm going to buy a fruit tree that's not going to be ready to the end of the season because it takes a whole damn season to grow, but I mean, I wanted to wanted to buy a fruit tree a lot earlier, but then I found out the only fruit trees that I really need aren't available until, like, they won't produce fruit until fall. So I don't need to worry that much. Let's just check the greenhouse real quick before I go into tune. Oh. Yams are ready. Awesome. Um, I'm gonna put the lower level... Oh, wait, there's way more yams. Or there's something, at least. A radish! Okay. But there's also more yams. <laughs> uh, and some grapes. Cool. Um, what are these? Are these, like, the weird rutabagas? Oh, that's ready, too. Potatoes! Did I only plant, like, an extremely small amount of potatoes? I guess I did. So my barn's done. Um, you'll notice that there's like little circle things above the feed. That means that the auto feeder has activated. Um, it's also way bigger. And I can now get different types of animals that were not available to me previously. So I'm gonna go to talk to Abigail. Cause damn it. <laughs> it wasn't my fault that I didn't. Oh my god, where did I leave my horse? Alright, I'll just walk. A squirrel! Ah, my cousin actually just recently posted that a squirrel broke into her house and started terrorizing her, which it's never happened to me. I don't, maybe they just have like weird trap doors everywhere and just squirrels wander in. Um, a largemouth bass for a tie. It is unlikely that I have an extra one, but I might. Um, and the gifts haven't reset, right? No. So that means Pierre. Pierre, you don't like me that much, do you? Oh, I'm in gifts. Yeah, I've already given him two. I've actually already given Abigail two gifts, so... No. It is only 10 o'clock. You still have to be here, Abigail. This is ridiculous. Okay, thank God. How's it going? I've been daydreaming a lot lately. Oh? You want to know what it's about? Well, it's a secret. Shouldn't have secrets. Well, you know, I guess everyone needs secrets. But, uh, you know, you don't have to be coy. We all know it's about me. But okay, at least I, uh, maintained the relationship for this day. Even though I didn't do anything to exalt it or anything. That's fine. I suppose. Um, hey there. Do you want mayonnaise? No, I've given you two gifts, too. My god. Hey. Graped. Yes. <laughs> Dad's coming back. So you've been saying that for so long. I don't know if your father's actually coming back. Ah! No, I gave away all the flowers. Um. You think she'll like this? No, I know, but I wasn't... There we go. Alright, you're telling me the crawdad story again. It's like every time I see you, it's about those crawdads. It's like all she thinks about. Um... Milk? Really? Milk? Okay. <laughs> Damn it, this controller is bothering me. I have to hit this button so much and it's like... It's just like already depressed, essentially, so when I press it, it doesn't go anywhere. Um, since I want to fill in tomorrow also... I think what I'm going to do is, at the end of the day, I'm going to try to meet Abigail, but I don't know if I want to show anything else, you know, because, uh, egg? Ugh. I've been too much of a Santa. Everyone's already had gifts. Um, yeah, I don't want to find on show too much, because I want to also fit in the next day, and, you know, having four, um, 
four events, you know, or four days, that's gonna, that's gonna be a lot. So I think I'm gonna spend most of the day fishing, actually. I'll eat my fish taco. And we'll just do some fishing and see, see how much money I can make until 8 o'clock. Let's do it. Alright, not a, not a bad haul. That should make me some money. I was hoping to get a largemouth bass, but I don't think I was fishing in the correct spot, so I had a 0% chance of doing that. And I will be able to enter... Okay, good. I did come at the right time. Hey, I was hoping you'd show up. I want to show you something. What was that she got there? See this? It's called a spirit board. Have you ever used one? Put your hands on the Polit show with me. The uh... Now the spirits will guide us towards the uh... Look, it, it's moving. First letter is I. The next is heart. Wow. Look at it go. Spelling out C R. I love C R. She loves cross. Oops, I accidentally knocked over the board. <laughs> uh, it's just a silly game. It doesn't mean anything. I, um... I have something to do. I have to go. Sorry. Huh, I didn't know that she watched my Let's Plays. Hmm. Very weird. That makes sense. She does have a Corona Trigger poster. She probably heard about the game from me. All of these are reasonable conclusions. Don't disillusion me. Alright. It is the 27th. Uh, I still didn't make as much fishing as I did farming. Also, I was so excited to try to meet Abigail that I did not, um... I, I didn't do any of the shopping things I was going to do, including buying that tree. In fact, if I buy the tree now that I was going to buy, it'll only be available for one day, producing fruit next month. Uh, hi. I just wanted to say sorry for acting weird yesterday. You probably understand what happened. Uh, okay, bye. I mean, you can stay. A lot of people like Cross Knight's Let's Plays. Oh, well. I don't know why she's being so shy about it. There, we got a bunch of maple syrup. Was maple syrup the thing that I was like, how in hell have I not put this in the community center yet? I think it is. Uh, yeah, I should do that. Also, a fried egg? Wait, really? Is that really? I can do that too, methinks. That'll be a nice little early community center run. So, fried egg. Boom. Alright, let's go put these two ingredients in there. Give those little gymnoses some syrup and some egg. Dun 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 dun. Alright, this one, so... No, not that one. We need the... It's just saying maple syrup everywhere. There we go. It's like a ghost has possessed the proceedings. Possessed? Possessed. All right, so I just need poppies, which I can't get for a while, and truffles, which I can't get until I get pigs. Though so I could go get a pig right now. I mean, not quite right now, because it needs to open, but... Also, it's Sunday. Is that weird woman there? I should go there first, because her prices are usually ridiculously high. Oh, and gifts have reset. Too early. Alright, fine. <laughs> to the weird woman! I don't even know if it's a woman, whatever. Uh, duck feather, don't need that. Cave carrot, spangle seeds, weird. Tulip plum pudding, random also. A large mouth bass? <laughs> what are the odds of that? And a rare crow. We can leave the rare crow. Okay, well now I can give Evelyn a uh, large mouth bass. 
But, um, let's go buy a new animal. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Oh. Alright, I'll wait. Boom! Weirds. I mean, I guess I understand her not wanting me to come in early. So, purchase supplies. I can now get a pig? Oh, that's it. Oh, a sheep! Alright, fair enough. Um, who is next on my list? Okay, fair enough. Uh, oh my god, that is so expensive. Well, let's just do it. You shall go... Here! <laughs> yes, sn snickered. No, in fact, your name is... Liam. One of the few Patreon supporters that I have that I know in real life. Alright, great. I'll send little Liam to her new home right away. The powerful Liam Pig. I think I might have gained weight. <laughs> Could it be from the exorbitant amount of alcohol that you consume every day? No, oh, alright, sorry, Shen. <laughs> sorry you don't like the thing. Um, syrup? Almost everyone likes syrup. Okay. Um, so, if I want to sell <laughs> the... If I want to buy that fruit tree, I need to sell something. Um, I do have cheese on me currently. Let's go, let's go do the animal stuff, though. And also, we'll get to meet Liam, the baby pig. So that'll be fun. And then I can sell it to him, and I should be able to buy, um... The... I don't know what it is. The useless sapling. Alright, little Liam seems curious. Just gonna bring that that milk right with me, I think. Goat Kiss has no milk right now. But he is being fed automatically. I do wish there was some type of... Um... Like, egg harvester or something. That's the thing, is most people who get animals, eventually they just... It's just that animals are not worth it after a while, monetarily. Um, like, at all. But... It, and it still just takes a large amount of time to take care of them. But the the automatic feeding helps a lot, <laughs> and I am gonna. I mean, it only helps during the winter, really. I mean, and when it rains, because otherwise they the automatic feeding is just letting grass grow on your farm. <laughs> that is enough. But just the collecting the eggs, like mm. you really just need a farm hand. And I think when they add the two player thing, you basically get a farm hand. But that's not what I mean. I knew, I mean like an automated farm NPC that can take care of your animals. And you pay them a percentage or something. Uh, there's your holly. I know what you like. Holly forever. <laughs> that is all I shall ever give you. But it's all you ever need, damn it. Eh. Hey there, Pierre. Um, let's see. Which one was 2000? The apricot sapling. That's what I want to sell you. Boom, or buy from you. Wow, you don't pay a lot for void eggs, huh? Is it because they're creepy and abyssal and from another world? Because I don't think that should factor into your decision. I think some people would be grateful to eat them. Uh, only grows in spring. Yeah, it takes 28 days. So it is going to be ready on the 28th day of spring and no other day. Which is why I meant to buy it, you know on like the second <laughs> but I didn't do that and I actually do I actually need an apricot I don't think so I actually did buy an apricot from that weird person so that's good because uh, I mean I could easily forget to harvest this thing on the last day <laughs> the only day that it's available and is Evelyn inside because it is really cold and she should not be outside ah her, well, her husband's gone <laughs> You should stay warm and take this. Oh, you saw the bulletin I posted. It looks perfect. Let me see what I owe you. And make sure to wear a jacket. I don't have a jacket. It's not part of my character model. But, uh, yeah, thanks for the cash. I mean, I actually lost out on that <laughs> because I bought it. But I wasn't doing it for the money. I was doing it for the friendship. The friend... Where... The friendship. 
She's pretty high up, so that's awesome. Um, yeah, a lot of people have higher things than Abigail. Whatever, we'll get Abigail up. Oh, was Abigail home? I didn't even, didn't even notice whether Abigail was home. Hey, it's Farmer Chrono. Oh no. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, there you are. <laughs> She's hiding. Whoa! Oh, they're at church. If I was rich, the first thing I would do is hire a maid and a chef. I've never been religious, but hey, I'm old. <laughs> what? I don't quite get the correlation, unless you're saying, I'm gonna die soon, so you know, I'm... <laughs> Yeah, I'll make my peace. Oh, hello. Remember that drawing I showed you of the orc? I entered in an online contest in 150G. That's awesome. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's, you know, I've played this game a lot, and I never actually saw anyone using the altar, so that's pretty cool. Oh, because it's Sunday. All right, that's why. Um, oh, and I can actually give Abigail gifts now, but I got rid of all my gifts. Oops. Oh well. Let's go to the farm and plant my tree. So where do I put it? it need, I need to put it in a place where it'll definitely grow. And I'll definitely remember it. Let's put it right here. There's nothing else around it. It should be fine. And I'll know not to chop that down. Um, I also think I want to go on a bit of a planting spree. This is another thing I should have done earlier. But I did it. So I'm gonna get... Let's get all variety of tree seeds. Not from there. <laughs> That's where you put things in, not where you get things. So I've been saving these like all game. I can make a whole bunch of field snacks with this, but let's not. Uh, we don't want to do any of this area, because this is all good crop areas. But like down here, let's like fill this place with seeds. Just gotta make sure that they're far enough apart. Alright. I think these might take a whole season to grow also, but, you know. I will, of course, eventually need more wood. I have so many of these seeds, it's ridiculous. I should probably sell some of them. That was weird. <laughs> oh, I think the menu moved up and down really fast. And it's actually getting a little bit dense there. And I don't want to put them near water. Because <laughs> then when I harvest them, there's a good chance all of it's just going to fall in the water, which is always really lame. That might be a bit too dense, but whatever. And now I'm getting too close to farmland, so... We're moving away. <laughs> There we are. Um, let's check you. Oh, I did. I did. I did good <laughs> as far as the hay production goes. The hay collection. Whoops! Didn't mean to axe you that horse. <laughs> eh. Yeah. Okay. Um. What do I do for the last day of winter? Hmm. I guess there there might be those weird winter shells, but I don't actually need another one of them. Um, you know what? It's going to be a huge day tomorrow. Like, a huge, exhausting day. Maybe I could just chill and, and take, take off. I could just go back to bed and be lazy. I might actually do that. Um... Final check. Yeah, it's actually, it's New Year's Day. I, it's kind of weird that there's no, like, New Year's Day celebration. But maybe they thought that and Christmas was too close together and they just picked Christmas because they knew more of what to do. Possible. Cranberries are ready. Excellent. It's just, this is a permanent supply. Of, like, these will always produce until I get rid of them forever. Like, for a hundred years on this farm, they would produce fruit. It's very valuable. With year over, I declare it. On to year two. Brilliant. 
Pretty good haul. Except not really. But I mean, for the amount of work that I did, pretty good haul. It is the first day of spring. Year number two. And I didn't look at living for the land. Oh wait, maybe this is it. Well, a new year has arrived. Keep your eyes peeled for new kinds of seeds being stocked in your local grocery store. Hopefully you've upgraded your tools during the winter and you're ready for a productive year. I should have read that next episode. Oh, snap! Uh, hello there. My name is Kent. I just got back last night from overseas. My wife told me that a new farmer had moved in while I was gone. But we'll learn a little bit more about that next episode. Yeah, that's how it always is. But yeah, it is year two, guys. Um, it's going to be much like the old year, except with one more girlfriend than previously. And also some new crops. And, you know, a vastly higher money-gaining potential than I had at the beginning of last year. So, I hope you'll join me. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope I can edit the video so that it's not super long because I did four days, plus an event. But we'll see! <laughs> um, yeah! Happy New Year! In game and out! I'll see you guys next time.